What's up my gorgeous chickadees? Welcome to today's diary entry. I'm Valeria Alicia. Today I'm bringing you a Ulta haul plus drugstore and then some because when I went to Generation Beauty, if you follow me on Twitter and Snapchat, you'll know that I left my tools, I left all my brushes when I went to Generation Beauty and so I was begging, begging my cousin. I was like, please take me to the Morphe store so that I can at least buy some brushes and he did. So thank you so much, cuz. And <laughs> so anywho, I wanna show you exactly what I purchased and my Ulta haul. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Let's start out with Ulta. I went to Ulta just to, you know, pass the time and not buy anything, just to see what they have. And uh, of course I ended up buying stuff. <laughs> it's just what I do. So I bought these two eyelashes from Ardell and these are the Ardell Wispies. Uh, the studio effects the demi wispies and the wispy they're very flirty and pretty i've never tried their studio effects but i definitely want to try them out they look so convincing and very very wispy the next thing i have here oh it's a beauty blender but this is actually i got at sephora when i went to la so oopsie i just made it into my ulta bag <laughs> Then I also got the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. I've never tried this mascara before, and if you guys know, I'm obsessed with L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. So I'm gonna give this one a go and see how I like it. Keeping it in the L'Oreal family, I think it was buy one, get one 50% off, and I was like, duh, I'm gonna get another one. Are you kidding me? I don't need an excuse to buy another product. So I got the Voluminous Primer Base. I've been wanting to try this, and if you guys wanna get it or forget a video, I would love to film one for you, so let me know in the comments down below. I have not used this primer yet and I used to love primers there was a covergirl mascara that had the primer on one side and the mascara on the other side and that used to be my favorite one I don't know if it's they still have it but I haven't used it in years so when I saw this I was like sign me up done and then the last thing I got from Ulta is the uh, Ulta brand lash uh, placement tool I've never used one of these thingies because I always use tweezers to put my eyelashes on so let's see how this works these uh, falsies applicator I guess it looks very different so I'm hoping that it makes the application a lot smoother and easier we shall see. From Walgreens. You guys are not gonna believe what I got from Walgreens. I think you guys already know but I'm gonna share it with you guys. I shared on Snapchat what I got and I think Twitter as well but um, three of these pairs of falsies I actually got from friends because I could not find these anywhere and these are the Elore and Nicole Guerrero collaboration you guys I got three of these right off the bat but I could not find this pair anywhere and these are the casually glamorous they're so beautiful and then these are the 143 so these I got on my own but these actually I had my friend Samantha and Melissa got these for me Melissa got me two pairs and Samantha got me one because I could not find them anywhere you guys and I've been wanting them for such a long time but I went to like no joke 10 plus Walgreens looking for these and nothing 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 they even said online that they had them in stock and I would show up and they didn't have them I was so heartbroken but I'm so happy that they got them for me and so thankful and then these are the other three that I purchased so let's just say that uh, I like Nicole Guerrero quite a bit. <laughs> so I cannot wait to try these. Last but certainly not least, let's talk Morphe. So from Morphe, this actually, I didn't have time to pick it up because I was in such a rush when I went in there. Because, you know, my cousin was with me and he's a guy and, you know, they don't get it when it comes to brushes. He kept looking at the brushes and going, they all look the same to me and I'm like, they're not the same, you just don't understand. The struggle is so real right now. But, <laughs> anywho, I wanted to get this uh, brush case, travel case, but I didn't get a chance to do so. And Melissa got it for me, so thank you so much, Melissa. She was like, you know what, I'm going to the Morphe store as well if there's anything you didn't get a chance to get. And I was like, this, 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 please get it for me. And she did, so I really like it. Jaclyn Hill talked about it in her snapchat or her twitter as well 
and so I've been wanting it for quite some time. I just find it so simple. It's just a square box and it's super easy to travel with. Okay, let's move on to brushes. I'm gonna go pretty quickly because there's quite a lot in here. But I want to start off with the sponge. I actually, oh my gosh, it's dirty because I just used it, guys. I've been using the heck out of it. So this is the Morphe sponge that Jaclyn Hill had been using on her videos recently. And I got to tell you guys, I actually really like it. I'm very impressed with it. But a little more about that a little later. If you guys want a dedicated video on that, let me know. I would love to film it for you. So another thing I got was this tweezers by Morphe, of course, to apply my falsies because I told you guys I love applying my falsies with these. And then also, here are the rest of the brushes. So some of them are dirty, some of them are still new, but these were the brushes that I used while I was on vacation in LA. So I repurchased the M439 brush. You guys know this is one of my favorite brushes. I use this brush to put on foundation. It is one of my favorite brushes to do just that. So I repurchased it and I never got a chance to use it. So I think I'm gonna pass this on to my mom or sister. Also a repurchase these two and this is the E22 and 310 brush. These two are so irreplaceable. I love these two. Also, I needed a brush to do my eyebrows, so I picked up the R44 brush and this is what it looks like. Kind of like the Anastasia Beverly Hills one, so you have the brush on one side and the spoolie on the other. Definitely had to pick it up. To pack on eyeshadow, I got the M561 brush. And these are the other two eye brushes I got. This is the 330 and the 433. And here are the last three brushes I got. So this is the E2, M570, and E4. I actually have this one already, but mine is the old packaging, which has the uh, white tips at the end. So as you can see, I have four brushes that I repurchased. <laughs> for this trip because I definitely was going to pack them, but uh, I don't take these brushes with me. I actually travel with my Luxie brushes, but I didn't have anything that was similar to it, so I definitely picked them up one more time and decided to, why not? So that is all for my Ulta slash Walgreens drugstore Morphe haul. Thank you so much for watching, my beautiful cheekies, and I will catch you on my next diary entry. Un besote. Bye. Don't believe me, just watch.